A very warm welcome to the Belmont Ground, the home of Whitstable Town Football Club. This is the Kent Football Association, the Merit Under-18 Boys Cup Final. It's Sheppard United against Chatham Town. Let's take a check on the two lineups. First of all, Sheppard United, their management team, Ross Wiles, Simon Beard, Adam Wicketts and Stuart Cruikshank. They will be playing in the red and white striped shirts and the black shorts. Their opponents today are Chatham Town. Their management team is Paul Scoville, Michael Patton, Jeff Greensmith and Kieran Quarrington. They are playing in the all-navy blue kit. Today's referee is Thomas Amber, assisted by Dylan Jeffrey and Ross Cooper. David Newby, the fourth official. Sam Wright releasing Kenzie Moynihan, who's got pace to burn. In comes across, too close to the goalkeeper, Rohan Jolt. Riding one challenge into the feet of Jack Marsh. That's a neat layoff, and this is Kenzie Moynihan who opens the scoring. Sheppard United get their early goal. Jack Marsh with the through ball. Kenzie Moynihan with the left-footed finish. The goalkeeper does come out, close the angle and got a touch, but he couldn't keep it out. The power of the shot from Moynihan was enough to carry it into the corner. And Sheppard United lead. Ten minutes gone and an early ball into the box, which is defended well by Sheppard. Toby Erefin, low drive. Wobbling through to goalkeeper Alfie Irvine. Free kick to be taken by Bailey Catherick. Is it outwards? Driven ferociously. It's headed up in the air by Harvey Broad. The shot was Kenzie Moynihan. It's a hefty but fair challenge. Referee plays a good advantage. Irafin. Into the feet of Garlinga. Out wide to... Freddie Ball tries to get the cross in. Goalkeeper gets a good touch on it. And again, he's into the penalty area. And I think the referee's going to give a penalty here. Yes, he is. It's a chance for Chatham to get themselves back level. It's been a good spell, this, from Chatham. And Harvey Broad is the man to step up from the spot. Broad shoulders. Harvey Broad makes it 1-1. No pressure on him at all. He just rolls it into the corner, sending Alfie Irvine the wrong way. And levels things off for Chatham Town. It's a very good penalty. Marvin Pike is giving it away. Tenacious from Sam Wright. Down the left. Sam Wright goes for goal himself. That wasn't very far away. forward by Goodwin, deep ball into the box, glanced away by Reedshaw, driven back in again and he couldn't just adjust himself in time, Jack Marsh another great drive, Moynihan using that speed and an effort towards goal it was Sam Wright and it was a good save by Rohan Jolt corner taken short looked in towards goal, saved by the goalkeeper, Alfie Irvin's feet, it was hit by Devlin and another chance goes whistling past the post <laughs> Sam Wright again another chance to drive forward the tackle on him was by Kian Garlinger the captain of Chatham and it's a free kick stoppage time at the end of the first half through the crowd straight at Rohan Joel who makes the save Devlin driving that's a neat through ball as well Wrestling to connect with it is Harry Beach. Good defending by Kenzie Moino. Lovely waving run forward. Good challenge coming in from Goodwin, but no, the referee says he didn't get the ball. Free kick. Toby Erifan runs over it. It's in towards goal. Good save. And it was Kirkwood Slack that couldn't quite convert the rebound. The whistle's gone anyway. It was Harvey Broad with the free kick. Good save by Irvin. And a foul. Foul on Erefin and the referee's lost his patience. It's a second yellow card for Blow Lando. And the Sheffield United defender has been ordered off. 
Down the middle from Michael Patton. That's good play. And that's Erafed who latches onto a brilliant pass by Joel Berwick and Toby Erafed who's been pivotal in everything going forward with Chatham Town has gone and burst clear and shows great composure to open up his body and strike it low and hard past Alfie Irvin with his right foot to make it 2-1 and back again by Tilly out wide from Urgan Pipe it's a good delivery it is a good delivery and it's a good header too Connor Tilly makes it 3-1 climbing to glance the ball into the corner past Alfie Irvine and Chatham Town take complete control of this cup final great delivery super header Sheppey United have got a long way to come back now having led early on a good burst into the penalty area has to check back Keenan Devlin does eventually get the shot in saved by Alfie Irvine free kick Catherick it's a far post headed away referee says shirt pull penalty a lifeline for Sheppey United late on Jack Marsh for the penalty spot. Goalkeeper guessed right, but it was right in the corner. Jack Marsh makes it 3-2 and it's game on. They needed a goal from somewhere. And they've left it very late. Drills it into the corner. The power took it through. All hands to the pump at the back there for Chatham. Holding on to this 3-2 lead. Header down off the line. And then off the line again. Two headers off the line. Corner. Everyone in there, including the goalkeeper, Irvine. Didn't go anywhere. It's cleared away. And there goes the final whistle. They've held out Chatham Town. They've come from behind at the Belmont ground to win the Kent FA Merit Under-18 Boys Cup. They have beaten Sheppey United in a very entertaining final by three goals to two. And there is... The player of the match, Keenan Devlin, had an excellent game for Chatham Town. Up to collect their runners-up medals, Sheppard United scored 16 goals without reply in round two against Bredhurst. They've also beaten Alsford, Folkestone and Victor Margate and Phoenix Sports on their way through to the final. But today wasn't to be their day. Come the players of Chatham Town. Well, they had to win on penalties in round one against Kennington Juniors. They squeezed past Ebbsfleet in round two, and then it just got better and better for them. They gained momentum. Hollands and Blair, Lordswood and Glebe beaten on their way to the final. And today they've come back. They've got grit, they've got determination. And they've shown great heart to come back again today and to beat Sheppard United 3-2. Now Captain Kian Garlinga has the trophy and it's congratulations to Chatham Town, the Kent FA Merit Under-18 Boys Cup winners for the 2022-2023 season.